everybody! I'm Eve the Mouse from the Mother Goose Club. Today I found this really cool building. So come on, let's go check it out. So this building says luck on top of it. I'm wondering what that could mean. Oh, it's so cool. It's made of marble and oh, there's this passageway. Let's see what's in this chest. Oh, cool. It's some unlucky blocks. Unlucky blocks? Normally they're lucky blocks. That's so weird. Normally they're good things, but these seem to be really unlucky. Well, I don't want to open these lucky blocks if they're not going to have good things inside. Well, what's what's in this? Uh, let's see what's in here. Oh, some torches and uh, some diamond uh, uh, equipment, like a shovel and a pickaxe. Well, let's let's go through the rest of this building and see what's inside. Maybe, oh, maybe it'll have more lucky blocks or some other cool things in there. Oh. D I G dig. Oh, so I guess it wants me to dig around here. Okay. Well, let's get digging. Let's see if we find anything cool. Maybe it'll have some lucky blocks in here instead of all the unlucky ones I found. Oh, look, guys, some iron ore. Let's dig that up. Okay, let's see. Oh, there's some more back here. Oh, man. So the thing about lucky blocks is they can be lucky, but also unlucky. So these here are unlucky, but I've heard you can craft unlucky blocks to be lucky again. Uh, I'm not sure how, but I'm sure this building has something to do with it. So let's see, we're digging. I really like digging. It's really fun in Minecraft. You never know what you're gonna find when you're digging. And sometimes, oh look, cool. Oh, I found some emeralds, that's awesome. Let's dig those up. Oh, and we've got some coal too. Oh, that's so cool. Yeah, see, you never know what you're gonna find. You might find some emeralds or coal or all sorts of ore. It's a lot of fun. Oh yeah, see, look, we've got some more, uh, some iron ore and, oh, look, another emerald. Awesome. Yeah, I love digging. Sometimes I like to dig as far down as I can and see what I can find. Sometimes you'll find lava or some water or even gold. It's so cool, but you've got to be careful. Sometimes if you dig too quickly, you can fall in the lava and die and lose all the cool stuff you found. It can get kind of scary, so you've got to be careful. So let's see, we'll dig these out. Oh man, I wonder how this built. <gasps> Do you guys know what that is? It's some diamond ore. Oh, that's awesome. We're going to dig it all out. And oh, look at all the diamonds we're getting. Oh, this is awesome. I'm sure if we craft the lucky blocks with some of these diamonds, it'll get really lucky. Oh man, I've opened some unlucky blocks that are pretty bad. Some of them, uh, they'll spawn lava and kill you right on the spot. Other times it'll just have uh, some more lucky blocks in them or zombies. I've gotten a couple zombies before too. Oh wow, I look so silly. Oh, it's a really tight space in here. Well, I'm gonna start digging again. Okay, let's see. We've got a bunch of coal up ahead and oh, look, there's some gold. Oh, I was just talking about how you could find gold. That's so cool. Oh, and some emeralds too. Oh man, this is awesome. I'm finding all sorts of cool things. Like, let's see, we've got some emeralds, oh, some ore, some diamond, a little bit of gold. Okay, let's, let's, uh, let's, oh, that's a sword, not a pickaxe. Okay, let's see. So, oh, there's more gold here. Perfect. Oh yeah. Oh, this is so cool. I love digging. It's so much fun. Oh, there's so much gold here. Oh, okay, so let's, let's go. Diamond! Oh, I didn't even see that! Oh, yeah, that's awesome! Okay, oh, I, I should find my way back up to the surface soon, though. There's, there's clearly more places I need to go, so let's start digging up a little bit. Oh, I can see the ceiling! Oh, there's some emeralds here! Okay, I'll dig a little bit this way and dig up here. Okay, let's head back up. Let's see. So I dug through a little bit around here. Well, I've got a handful of things. Uh, you know, let's do it. Let's dig in this corner right here a little bit. And uh, we'll see if I can find anything else. Oh, look, some diamond. Yeah, that's awesome. And some iron, too. Okay, that's perfect. So a little bit here. Got some XP for digging up some diamonds. That's awesome. Let's see what else. What else? Anything else? Well, 
Oh, that's the thing about digging in Minecraft. You can get really into it. And if you have other things you're supposed to be doing, well, before you know it, you've just dug up the whole place. Okay, well, I think I've got a bunch of cool stuff. So let's go to the next room here. So, oh, oopsies. So we'll press that button and walk through the door. Oh, I keep missing. Oh, sometimes digging gets me disoriented. Oh, okay, cool. So we're in the next room. Let's see. Oh, there's a bunch of lava, a couple furnaces, and oh, some chests. Oh, there's some coal in this chest. What's in this one here? Oh, let's see some more coal. Oh, I get it. It's to uh, get some of the stuff out of the ore I, ha I found. Okay, so let's see. We'll put some coal here, and we'll put some iron ore right there. And we've got some gold ore, so let's put that in this one here. There we go. And that'll give me some gold and some iron. That Oh, that'll be great. So let's see what else I have. We've got some emeralds and some diamonds. And okay, the rest of this, is, I don't think it's gonna help me very much, but let's see how this is doing. Oh yeah, so the iron, we've got some ingots. Okay, perfect. And how's this one doing? Yeah, and we got a gold ingot. Okay, so looks like we just gotta do a little bit of waiting until these are done. Oh man, I think everything's done. Yeah, it looks like everything's finished up here. Yeah, so we've got a bunch of ingots. We have seven in total, and we have uh, five gold ingots. That's pretty good. So we've got six emeralds, seven iron ingots, five gold ingots, and nine diamonds. Oh, that's pretty cool. Well, looks like we're supposed to head through here next. Oh, it looks like uh, there's a bunch of vines growing in here. Oh, that's pretty cool. Well, let's get climbing. Oh, I love climbing, all sorts of things, trees and rocks, it's so much fun. Oh, let's see, uh, let's try going this way. Let's jump here, and we'll climb up this one, and yeah, this is so cool. Oh, I can't believe that a building like this just uh, is around to, to have all these lucky blocks in it, and oh, we made it up to the top, and oh, there's a chest here. It's got a golden apple in it. That's awesome. Oh, I'm sure that'll be great for these uh, unlucky blocks. Oh, so we're going this way. Oh, I have to jump down into that water. Oh, it's so high up. That's a little scary. Well, maybe it could be fun. Okay, I'm gonna jump, even though I'm kind of nervous. Okay, three, two, one, and jump. Ah! Whoa, oh, that was kind of fun. Oh man, oh, that was pretty cool. Sometimes I'm scared of heights, but I always find that when I, I overcome my fears and just go for it, it's a lot of fun. <laughs> oh, oh cool, there's a crafting block over here. Let's see, so I can, uh, so if I put the unlucky block on the crafting table and put some stuff here, it can make it lucky again. Oh, see, look at that. This one's already got some luck to it. Let's put a couple emeralds here and see if we can make it a bit luckier. Okay, that one looks pretty good. We'll, we'll take that lucky block out and put uh, one of the other unlucky blocks in. So that one's still pretty unlucky. Let's put some diamonds around and see what that does. Oh, this one's still pretty unlucky. Maybe if I reorganize it, something cool will happen. Oh, see, it's adjusting a little bit, huh? Okay, let's do that, and let's put some iron here too. Okay, so that's as good as I can get for this lucky block. Let's put it back here, and oh yeah, it's starting to get a little bit luckier now. Okay, let's put these in here, and uh, yeah, okay, that one looks pretty good. Let's see, let's put some gold in this one and see what happens, there we go. Oh, that one's still pretty unlucky, let's, uh, Let's try it again. Hmm, let's reorganize this a little. Okay, that one looks pretty good. Let's put this back here. And oh, this one doesn't seem to be getting any luckier. Oh, looks like I didn't get enough ore or anything. Okay, well, you know what? I don't think I can go back since I jumped down, but let's open these lucky blocks and see what they look like. Let's open up the unlucky ones first and let's be careful, okay? We'll do it right over here in case it explodes. So we'll put this here and uh, okay, I'm gonna get my sword out and let's be careful. Okay, and boop, oh, I missed. Okay, there we go. Oh no, oh man, let's dig our way out of here real, oh, I didn't make it, that's all right. Let's uh, see where I am now. Oh, I'm in the middle of nowhere, that's really weird. Well, let's, uh, let's spawn these lucky blocks and see if they can help me out. 
So we'll put one in here, and let's open this one and see what happens. Oh, a bunch of chicken! Oh, that's delicious! I love chicken! Oh, but I'm not hungry right now, so let's open this slightly unlucky block. It's not fully unlucky, so it shouldn't be too bad. Oh! Oh, wow! It was actually pretty cool! It gave me a bunch of TNT and all sorts of other things! <gasps> that's so cool! Well, okay, let's let's open the, uh, the last lucky block and see what happens. Okay, and there we go. And, oh, a bunch of Mr. Rainbow Sheepies! Hello, sheeps! Hello! Hi! Hi! Oh, man, that was so cool! That was so much fun! Well, you know what I think we should do? Let's set off this TNT as a, a, a final goodbye! So we'll put one here and a bunch here, and there we go! Awesome! So let's see. Oh, it looks like I don't have any flint, though. How am I going to set these off? Well, let's just hit them. Oh, oopsies. <laughs> okay, hmm. Maybe I can use a redstone torch to set it off. Let's, uh, let's try it. Oh, okay, well, that's all right. We'll just put, yeah, there we go. All right, it's going to explode. Get ready, guys. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that was so much fun. Oh, wasn't that cool, Mr. Rainbow? Oh, yeah, you're a green Mr. Rainbow. Oh man, and look at all these blocks, and oh, so, some coal there. Well, I should uh, harvest it. Well, thanks for playing with me, guys. It was so much fun opening Lucky Blocks with you. Bye! Hey, everybody. I'm Eve the Mouse from the Mother Goose Club. Today, I'm checking out the Coliseum. So, the Coliseum is this cool building here that inside has a bunch of neat weapons to try out. And uh, after I pick out some weapons, there's a bunch of mobs on the inside for me to fight. So we're gonna try out a bunch of swords today. So let's see which ones I wanna try. Oh, this one looks pretty cool. It's called Aether's Guard. Ooh, and it has Ascension 3 on it. That's pretty cool. All right, so we're gonna test that one out. And ooh, this one looks pretty neat. What is it? Let's see, an I-N sword. It's got Ender Pulse 3 on it. That's pretty cool. We're gonna give that a try too. Huh, this one looks kind of boring. I don't like that one. Eh, let's see what else. Oh, that's just a diamond sword. Diamond swords are pretty cool, but I already have one of those. Whoa, whoa, this one looks super cool. Let's see what that is. The Dawn Star with Ignite 3. Oh, that looks really cool. Okay, okay. Oh, and this one looks awesome too. Glacial Blade. Oh, that one has two things with it. That's pretty neat. So that's a golden sword. That's an iron one. Ooh, this one's green. Let's see what this is. Gladilus. Oh, Venomous Aspect. That's pretty cool. Okay, so let's see. Yeah, I think that's enough to get going. All right, I'm going to put on some armor to keep me safe from all the mobs that are in here. So let's see. Diamond armor. There we go. And now I've got all these swords. So let's start with Aether's Guard. Yeah, let's do that. So yeah, this is the Colosseum. Inside it's got a, a bunch of cages with all sorts of mobs in them, like skeletons and zombies. But let's start with the skeletons. Oh, it looks like there's a bunch in there. Okay. Whew. Let's go! All right, skeletons, come at me! Oh, that one tried to shoot an arrow at me. Ow! Oh, that one kind of hurt, but good thing I'm wearing a bunch of armor. All right, let's uh, uh, take that, and that, and take that, and yeah! Oh, I'm getting them, take that! Oh, ow! Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna move back a little bit. Come at me, guys, come over here! Oh yeah, so there's three of them, okay. Let's uh, get real, ow! Okay, and jump! And, oh, they're all getting me really good. Okay, let's zigzag, and maybe they won't be able to hit me. Ow! Oh, ow! Okay, let's, let's take that, and take that, and take that! Yeah, I got one, I got one! Take that, and take that! Oh, it's shooting them up into the air! Take that! Oh, man, this guy's going for me. Take that! Yeah! Oh, man, we got all the skeletons! Whoa, and look at all of the uh, arrows around! Oh, there's another one! Oh, man, I missed him! Okay. So we'll go this way, and uh, take that, and that, and take that, and that, and that, and yeah, I got them all, I got them all. Okay, let, let's shut this door so no more skeletons come out. Well, that was pretty cool. Well, let's try a different one. Let's try the I-N sword. Hmm, zombies, uh, I don't know. Let's try, what's over here? We got some creepers and some zombie pigmen. Oh, that's pretty cool. 
Well, let's do the creepers. Actually, no, 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 let's do the zombie pigmen. They look so cool. Okay, let's open that door. Zombie pigmen, come on out. Hi, guys. Oh, they have swords, too. Okay, well, let's, uh, let's attack them. Take that. Ow. So, what's cool about this one is I can teleport with it. Like over here. Ta-da. Take that. And that. And yeah, take that. And oh, let's jump this way. Okay, see, look how far away I am from those zombie pigmen. And over here. Yeah. So it hurts me a little bit whenever I teleport, but it seems pretty cool. Okay, so let's teleport to this one. Yeah. And take that, you zombie pigman. Take that. Yeah. Oh, we got him. So this is a pretty cool sword, but it looks like if I want to... Oh, yeah. If I teleport around it, it, it hurts me. So I don't think uh, I'll be using this one much more. Oh, I'm going to take a health potion. Oh, man. Look, I'm covered in arrows from all those skeletons. Oh, that's pretty funny. So we're going to drink that. And that should help me out a little bit. Uh, let's let's eat some apples, too. Uh, get my, my hunger up to snuff. There. Oh, I just didn't finish that one. There we go. And let's have the potion of regeneration. Yeah, that should be good. Okay, so... We tried out the uh, Aether's Guard and the Iron Sword. So let's try out the Gl yeah, Gladilus next. So this one has Venomous Aspect on it, and that's good for, for killing creepers. So let's, uh, let's spawn a bunch of creepers out here. Okay, creepers, come on out. Creepers, oh, here comes one. Hey there, creeper, don't worry. Take that, and oh yeah, see, oh, he exploded, okay. But he got poisoned beforehand. Okay, so take that, you creeper. Oh, I missed. And take that. Oh, oh. I ran away fast enough that he didn't explode. Okay, take that, you creeper. Oh. Oh, he exploded. Oh, and he killed that other creeper. Oh, that's so funny. Well, let's see. Well, this is pretty cool, but I think it's only really good for fighting creepers. So let's try. Oh, there's another one. Let's get him. Take that. And oh, no. Oh, he, he didn't explode. But look, he's poisoned. You can tell. Take that. Oh, yeah. Oh, whoa. Look at that. Okay. Well, that's all right. I, 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 this is cool, but I think I'm going to give the, uh, the glacial blade a shot. So let's see. Let's try that out on... Oh, there's some silverfish here. Let's, uh, let's try those. Oh, you can see I'm trying to get through the door. Okay. Let's, uh, let's go. Oh, come here, silverfish. Whoa, that's a lot. Take that, and that, and that, and ow. Oh, these guys are fast. Take that. Oh, but see the glacial blades slowing them down a little. Take that, and that, and oh, man, they're following me. Oh, they're so silly looking. Oh, and take that, and yeah, I'm getting them. Ow, that hurt. And take that, and that, and ow. Oh, man, these guys drop a lot of experience points, though. Take that, and that. And take that! Yeah, I got him! Oh, there's a couple stragglers around. I'm gonna get them. Oh, uh, take that! Yeah! And take that! And oh, there's a couple more over here. Let's get them. Let's take that! And oh, did I not? Oh, I didn't kill it! Take that! Yeah! And yeah! Oh! Oh, there's a couple more! Take that! And that! Man, they're just silverfish everywhere. Let's 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 close this door before some more come out. There we go. Okay. Well, the Glacial Blade is pretty cool. I think that one's my favorite so far. Oh, let's collect all these experience points. There we go. And now we have the Dawn Star. This one looks so cool. Well, let's use it on zombies. Zombies are the best to fight. So let's open that door and this door. Zombies, come on out. Zombies. Oh, there's one. Okay. Hope they're coming out now. So take that. Oh, wow. Oh, man, it's not even daylight out. That means that... The, ow! Oh, that really hurt! Oh, I gotta be careful! Take that! Yeah! It looks like the Dawn Star lights, uh, lights zombies on fire! That's so cool! Oh, ow! Oh, I can't get too close, so I really gotta be careful! Yeah, if I light one on fire, I only have to hit it once, and then it can die from being lit on fire! Oh, yeah, that's so cool! Oh, man! Oh, that one, that one, uh, went out! Let's get that one, and this one, and take that! Oh, yeah, look at it! Oh, awesome! Oh, I got them all! Oh, the Dawn Star is awesome! Oh, I love it! Okay, okay. Oh, this one might be my favorite. Let's try it out on some slimes next. Just because I, I want to make sure I really like this one. Okay, slimes, come on out. Oh, let's open the other door, too. Slimes, slimes! There we go. 
Hey there, slimes. Come on out. Don't worry. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's awesome. It, it, it kills the slime so fast. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, I definitely like the Dawn Star. That's awesome. Any more slimes want to come out and uh, have a little battle real quick? Come on, slimes. Oh, there's a couple more still in there. You gonna come out? Yeah, all right, all right, take that. Oh, yeah, oh, they, they, they break up so quickly. And that, and that, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's so cool. Well, let's, let's close this up here. I think I'm done fighting slimes for today. Oh, guys, that was so cool. Oh, man, these swords are all so awesome. They all have their own special abilities. That is so cool. Well, you know, I had a lot of fun. But I think my favorite is definitely the Dawn Star. The Dawn Star is just the coolest and it lights things on fire. Oh, that's totally awesome. Well, I'm gonna put the other ones back. And then, uh, and then uh, I'll take this one and we can head out and fight some, some uh, monsters out in the real world. So the Aether's Guard goes here and the Iron Sword goes here. And let's see, I think the Glacial Sword is over this way. There we go. So this one goes here, and then this one goes right here. Yeah, that's pretty cool, but I'm going to take the Dawn Star with me. Hopefully uh, someone else can come back and take some of these cool swords too, or, or maybe try out the ones I didn't get the chance to, to fight some, some mobs with. Oh man, well I had so much fun playing with you guys today. Thanks for trying out all these cool swords. Oh man, well, I'll see you again soon. Bye! everybody, I'm Eat the Mouse from the Mother Goose Club. Today, I'm going fishing. Come on, let's go. So, I like to come out here to the fishing hole. It's not too far from my house whenever I want to go fishing. It can be a lot of fun. And the best part is, is after you catch the fish, you can cook them up and eat them. Oh, they're just such a tasty snack. And I'm kind of hungry, so that makes it the perfect time to go fishing. So, uh, it's a little bit early in the morning. The sun isn't even all the way up. That's the perfect time to go fishing. That's when the fish are out. So I'm just going to uh, cast my rod into the water. Now the important part about fishing is having patience. You need to wait and wait and wait for a fish to show up. Oh. Oh man, I'm just, I'm so hungry. Uh, oh, I caught a lily pad. I can't eat a lily pad. Get back in the water. Oh, I'm just so hungry that uh, I don't want to wait to catch any fish though. Huh, well, I have an idea. I heard somewhere that if you put TNT in the water and light it on fire, it'll blow up all the fish into the air and then they'll all land on your dock and you'll have plenty of fish to eat. Oh, isn't that great? Oh, so let's, I'm gonna, I have some TNT right here. So I'm gonna give that a shot. So let's see, I'm gonna put some out here for the TNT to sit on. And uh, yeah, that should be enough. And we'll put some TNT here and some here. And oh, I guess we can put one there too. Yeah, that should be plenty. So I'm gonna light this TNT and let's see what happens. Oh, I really hope I get some fish. Whoa! Whoa! Oh, that was so cool! Oh, but, but there are no fish. Oh, that didn't get any fish at all. There's no fish on my dock. Oh, I guess, I guess I'll just have to keep fishing then. All right, well, let's cast the rod again. Okay, well, another good way to make the, the time go by faster when you're fishing is to sing. I also hear it in a... It attracts some fish, so let's sing a song. Uh, sing along with me if you know this one. One, two, three, four, five. Once I caught a fish alive. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Then I let it go again. Ugh. Well, I, I guess that didn't work either. Oh man, well. Uh... Oh, oh, I have another idea. Another way you can make fishing a little bit easier in Minecraft is to enchant your fishing rod. So let's give that a shot. In this chest we keep here uh, on the fishing dock, I've got everything I need 
to start enchanting. So let's grab uh, a couple bookshelves, some uh, lapis, and uh, an enchanting table. So here's how it works. First, you put out your enchanting table, and then you can uh, enchant your rod. But I can also put some books around it. This uh, makes the enchanting table even better. I like to put some around it whenever I try and enchant things. So let's get started. So let's put the rod here. And oh yeah, sweet, here we go. I can use some of my, uh, my power to uh, enchant this fishing rod. So let's try this one. Let's see, oh, so this fishing rod has unbreaking one. Basically that means that this rod can't break now, but uh, normally uh, what helps to make fishing rods better is the uh, enchantment lure, but let's try this one and see if it, it uh, helps me catch fish even more. Huh, so let's see, we just have to wait, wait some more, and I could do some more singing, but that didn't work last time. Oh, I really wish I could catch some fish, but I'm just, oh, 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 I didn't catch it, I missed. Oh, I guess this isn't working well. There's another way you can enchant a fishing rod in order to catch uh, more fish. And this one is by using an enchantment book and an anvil. So I've got this enchantment book for lure level three here. So I'm gonna enchant my fishing rod on this anvil here and see if uh, that'll help. There we go, so I can afford it. So I just enchanted that fishing rod. So not only does it have unbreaking level one, it also has lore level three. So it's a super good fishing rod now. I'm sure this will help me catch a fish. It's gotta. Oh man, I really hope that I catch a salmon. Salmon are my favorite fish in the whole world. I like to eat them on bagels or grilled up. Oh, they're so tasty. But okay, okay, we just gotta wait here patiently now. I don't see any fish yet, but they gotta be around here soon. Oh man, I'm just so hungry. I can't stop thinking about fish. Oh, okay. Oh, I think I see one. Oh, oh yes, I got it. And it's a salmon, my favorite fish in the whole world. Yes, yay. Oh, that rod is awesome. I'm glad we took the time to enchant it and everything. Oh, this is great. Okay, so I'm gonna grill it up on this furnace now. So we'll put the salmon here and we just gotta wait a little bit till it's done cooking. Oh, I love fishing, it's so much fun. And I'm pretty sure that the fish tastes better if you catch it yourself. See, look, here's the cooked salmon. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, I can't wait to have some. Oh, guys, look, it looks so tasty. Oh, okay, okay, I'm gonna eat it. Uh, Oh, that was so good. I'm so full. Oh, I love salmon. Well, thanks for going fishing with me, guys. I had a lot of fun. Come fishing with me again soon.